Um, Bob, there's a couple questions here. This one's from Ellie. Uh, not understanding what frequencies and vibrations are. Well, hold your hand in front of your face. Look at it. Your hand is made of energy. It's energy that's vibrating. It looks to be solid and it looks to be cell, but it's not. At the best, it's a sieve. If you put a microscope between your eye and your hand, you'd see a mass of energy moving. The movement is called vibration. Everything in the universe vibrates. Take that microscope and look at anything from a, a granite table to a, a plastic bottle, and it's all energy, and you'll see it move. Clothes you're wearing is energy. Frequency is the speed it's vibrating at. Wood is on a different frequency than steel. Thought is the highest frequency you can get involved in. Thought waves are cosmic waves. Now, you're not going to learn that by me answering a question right now, but if you stick around and you study this, you're really going to start to understand it. You're thinking on a frequency. You're living on a frequency. And what you're attracting into your life is the only thing you can attract because it's, it's on the same frequency you're on. Negative people attract negative people. Positive people attract positive people. Wealthy people attract wealth. Poor people attract poverty. What we've got to do, we've got to understand, we control the vibration we're in. When my income went from 4,000 to over a million, I had just changed the frequency that I was living on. The wealth was already here. Nothing's created or destroyed. So what do we have to do? We have to get in harmony with the good we desire. That's what we teach. Saturate your mind with this information. That's what I've done. 